Like and subscribe right now, or this spider will crawl on your face while you're sleeping. Today we brought you the 10 most advanced robots in the world. From a handy healthcare robot to sturdy mechanized heroes, we have an impressive array of robotic fellows. Automation has fascinated us for millennia, yet from medieval automats to today's robots, there is a vast difference. We are tempted to scare away from robots. We have read and watched too many smart and challenging stories about the struggles between humankind and highly intelligent machines. However, many brilliant minds out there aren't afraid of a Terminator-like apocalypse. Be calm. Today we won't show you weaponized garbage. Indeed, we will show you incredible machines capable of helping us to advance as humankind and achieve new horizons. Come with us today and enjoy the 10 most advanced robots in the world. Number 10. Samsung BotCare At the 10th spot, we brought you a handy robot for Pandemic's times. Thanks to our Pandemic's experience, we value a lot more automated healthcare. We are sure that healthcare robots will play a dramatic role in the future, especially after learning how vulnerable our doctors and nurses are when dealing with infectious diseases. Hopefully something like Samsung's BotCare will be more common soon. Samsung's BotCare is a healthcare assistant. Samsung's project team worked thinking about elderly family members the robot tracks vital signs, including heart rate, breathing, blood pressure, and can monitor sleep quality. BotCare software enables it to remind users to take their medication and guide them through their daily workout. As cool as it is, it integrates and syncs with smart home devices to detect falls. When the BotCare detects a user's fall, it will come to the user's rescue and connect them with family, friends, or emergency services, depending on its setup. We are sure it could be helpful right now with some Pandemics plugins, don't you think? Before we move on, I've got a little challenge for you that will take just five seconds to complete. So here's the deal. You just leave a like on this video, smash that subscribe button, and hit the notification bell and you get 25 years of amazing luck. Try it. It really works. Number 9. Baxter We found an industrial robot that reminds us of those vintage videos about famous Japanese cars factories for spot number 9. They showed us tons of robotic arms across an assembly line working hastily. Rethink Robotics is currently part of a Han Group, although it was a Boston-based startup in its beginnings. Baxter was its first significant release. It was a two-armed industrial robot with an animated face. It was three feet tall and weighed 165 pounds without its pedestal. With its pedestal, it was between 5 foot 10 inches and 6 feet 3 inches tall and weighed 306 pounds. Most of the work it performed was related to simple industrial tasks like loading, unloading, sorting, and handling materials. According to Baxter Brooks, the startup founder and first CEO, the company designed the robot to perform production's line's dullest tasks. Although Rethink's Robotics released a smaller, lighter, and more flexible robot after Baxter's success, the market still considers it a pioneering and disruptive product. Baxter had an animated screen displaying a face with several expressions to show the robot's status. Baxter was among the first robots to adapt to its environment, bringing more safety to the industrial context. The robot had sets of sensors on its head to detect people nearby and give Baxter the ability to adapt to its environment. Unlike most industrial robots, Baxter discerns when to adapt. Previously, most industrial robots would either shut down or continue running incorrectly after environmental changes. Number 8. Piaggio Gita Cargobot At the 8th spot, we found you a cute but peculiar robot. The Gita is a tiny workhorse, able to deal with 40 pounds of cargo. Piaggio Fast Forward, a Boston-based startup and subsidiary of Piaggio, created the Gita as a cargo-carrying robotic vehicle. The bot can roll up to 22 miles per hour, not bad as a running or cycling companion. Piaggio Fast Forward project team designed the Gita to follow a person carrying her personal cargo. We can think of many applications for it, such as commuting, moving, and short road trips. According to its manufacturer, the Gita uses various cameras and sensors to navigate. It has a battery life of 8 hours, which can be fully charged in 3 hours. We are sure it would fit amazingly with some glamping spots. Number 7. Now. At the 7th spot, we found something more human-like. Now is autonomous programmable humanoid robot. The Paris-based firm Aldebron Robotics created this impressive robot. Yet, in 2015, SoftBank Group acquired the company and rebranded it as SoftBank Robotics. The robot's development started in 2004 with Project NOW and has been evolving dramatically. In 2007, NOW replaced Sony's robotic dog, Ibo, in the RoboCup Standard Platform League. 
The latter is an international soccer competition where the contenders deal with a set of challenges. The most exciting bit about this competition is that the robots play against each other completely autonomously. Since now is a standard platform, the competition challenges have contributed to its evolution and multiple developments. Currently, now has an academics edition for universities and laboratories. It has dealt with a wide array of challenges through its RoboCup. Number 6. Ibo. At the 6th spot, we brought you one of your favorites. Sony's Ibo is an entertainment robotic dog. In Japanese, Ibo means companion, so it isn't surprising that Sony's designers chose a dog as their inspiration. Ibo is a clever wordplay as well. It is also an abbreviation for artificial intelligence bot. Sony designed Ibo to be a robotic pet. One of the most attractive features of the robot is that its interactive capabilities with its human owner. In some ways, it emulates a living pet without the inconveniences. Experts assert that Ibo is an autonomous robot, which means that it can learn, mature, and deal appropriately with its surroundings. Ibo is a funny and cute bot with some advanced features. Moreover, it has a powerful CPU, articulated movement, and accurate sensors. Furthermore, Sony proprietary software enables entertaining interactions with dynamic and need simulations. One of the most interesting things about Ibo is that it's learning ability. Furthermore, the robotic dog can mature as it learns. It improves faster with practice and human interaction. We would love to have one, would you? Or would you prefer to having a real Rufus? Number 5. Valkyrie Robot For spot number 5, we have a robot from another planet. NASA's R5 is an engineering marvel. Nicknamed Valkyrie, the robot comes from the Johnson Space Center, JSC, engineering doctorate's brilliant mind. The team designed it and built it to complete the, in the 2013 DARPA Robotics Challenge, the DRC Trials. The Valkyrie name comes from North mythology and refers to brave, skilled female warriors. Following Valhalla's inspiration, the robot is sturdy, adaptable, and resistant. After the robot's appearance at the 2013 DRC trials, the Valkyrie team improved it. Currently, the hands are more reliable and durable, the ankle performs better, and it has upgraded sensors. The Florida Institute for Human and Machine Cognition, the IHMC, collaborated with the Valkyrie team, implementing walking algorithms on NASA hardware. We want one Valkyrie to come with us on our next Mars trip. Or perhaps two. Number four, Pepper. For spot number four, we brought you a spicy fellow. SoftBank's Robotics, which we mentioned before when talking about now, created Pepper as a well. Pepper is a semi-humanoid robotic featuring the ability to read emotions. Yes, just like the T-1000. Isn't that shocking? In 2014, SoftBank Robotics displayed Pepper for the first time and later showcased it in Japan's SoftBank mobile phone stores. Unlike the T-1000, Pepper is not a weaponized humanoid. Lucky for us. On the contrary, Pepper is an entertainment and social robot. The Pepper team designed it to enable relationships, connect people, and entertain. The Pepper team hopes that independent developers will create new content and applications for Pepper. Currently, Pepper is a receptionist at several offices in the UK, and it uses proprietary technology to identify visitors, send alerts for meeting organizers, and coordinate refreshments for guests. Pepper can chat autonomously with prospective clients, and we would love to give it a try. Number 3. Paro For spot number 3, we brought you the cutest robot ever. Paro is a therapeutic robot baby harp seal. As you could imagine, their creators designed it to be impossibly cute. Takanori Shibata is its creator, a renowned expert at the Intelligent Research Institute of Japan's AIST. Paro's cuteness isn't frivolous. According to research, its appearance and behavior have a calming effect and helps patients with their emotions. In some way, it emulates animal-assisted therapy. The world knew about this cutie in late 2001. Since then, Paro has been used primarily in care institutions. To this day, it is a valuable therapeutic alternative for dementia and autism patients. Now, get ready for today's best pick. A DARPA robotic champion capable of heroic feats. Today's best pick is Atlas. Boston Dynamics created Atlas under the oversight of the United States Defense Advanced Research Department's agency, DARPA. Yet, as many would suspect the robot was about to become a weaponized Terminator, 
the Department of Defense has denied such an interest. Indeed, Atlas is a bipedal humanoid robot capable of a comprehensive set of search and rescue tasks. Its features enable Atlas to aid emergency services in search and rescue operations. When humans can't deal with the temperature, harsh weather, dangerous terrain, and any other hazard, Atlas can make a difference. Atlas has demonstrated its ability to do challenging tasks, such as driving, running across rubble, removing debris, opening doors, climbing industrial ladders, using tools to break through concrete panels, and manage extreme fires. Handy, huh? And number one, Osimo. Winning the first spot today, we brought you one of the most advanced robotic pioneers. Osimo was among the first intelligent robots capable of dealing with human interaction and recognizing complex stimuli. A fantastic machine, Honda created it in 2000. After it evolved in its last version in 2018, it is a part of the Miryakan Museum permanent exhibition in Tokyo, Japan. In 2018, Honda posted the last update of Osimo through their official page. Although it seemed that the robot didn't offer any more advanced or practical use, Osimo's development nurtured a whole set of technological applications for the company. Osimo can recognize moving objects, postures, gestures, their surrounding environment, sounds, and faces. It's capable of dealing with human interaction and detecting complex movements around it. As a pioneering achievement, Osimo is still one of the most advanced robots in the world. Well, today's countdown was quite a challenge. We loved every single robot on today's list, and we are sure that you enjoyed most of them. Which was your favorite? Would you like to buy one? And if you could pay for it, which one would you have? Let us know what you're thinking and keep watching for our great content.